This is artifacts of Mars. And I'm kind of saddened by the fact that so many heterosexual men are being fooled by some of these dancing videos and such. I've read the comments. They think that these are real girls. This is Mr. Dancing Girl videos. Well, there are others on YouTube besides Mr. Dancing Girls. These folks are not, not women at all. These are not female. They're either tra the so-called transgendered, which is an operation which up to me would be banned. Anybody who wanted to have their tallywhacker removed to become a girl, quote-unquote, and be put into a mental hospital if it was up to me. Was, they're mentally ill. They're sick. At any rate, there's a number of ways you can tell so-called transgendered. And there's a number of ways way you can tell that these are uh, men or women. One way you can tell is by the height. Men are naturally taller than women. It just goes with species. We're taller, we weigh more. Usually. Another another way you can tell is by the hip hip width. Because the hips are just wider and women, because they, they're the ones that bear children. Without well, women to bear children, there's no uh, human race. Uh, I mean, human race is completely dependent at the moment on women bearing children. There's nothing, no machine that can ever replace what a mother does. So, there's a couple things. The size of the extremities, hands and feet, is one indication. And their feet are pretty large. Their feet and hands. The hips, the height, and one other thing you'll notice, one other way to tell, is the uh, size of uh, they, uh, drag queens and assorted weirdos tend to wear, uh, heavy eye shadow. It's a psychological thing. It tends to attract heterosexual men. I don't really know why, but it just does with us. So... It says, traditional dancers on stage, oops. Now, I don't know if anybody here can read Russian or not. These are not traditional dancers. These are either drag queens or the transsexuals. I would lean towards transsexuals. Now, we'll take a look at a few clips from other uh, videos. Or maybe I'll move this one forward. Hang on. Now, I've muted the sound so we can watch this video. See how tall they are? How muscular their legs are? These are guys. Uh, and some of you are going around on uh, YouTube, as I do, looking for uh, beautiful pictures of beautiful girls. Beautiful videos. These are guys. They're either drag queens or transsexuals. You see enough yet? If not, I can come up with more. You know, put this on hold, and then we'll take a look at some other videos. Okay, if you didn't believe me before, this should do it. This is another Mr. Dancing Girls video. This one's so blatant that, uh... There's no denying it. Mr. Dancing Girls isn't the only one. That was my fault. I screwed up. Um, 
Take a look at the hips. I think I'm going to back this off a little bit. Hang on. Alright, take a look at the hips. And the eyes. The hips are narrow. And these are relatively tall. These are guys. They're probably transsexuals, actually. That would be my guess. These are guys. They're queers. They're... These are not real girls. If this one doesn't do it for you, nothing will. And you had the freakazoids that came through at the beginning of the video. They're pretty good, but they're not real girls. I'm sorry. The hips are too narrow. Legs are very muscular. Hands are larger than women's hands are. See if they give me a good look at the feet. And that really looks like they're wearing them little half socks or whatever they are. These are guys. A lot of you have been simply bamboozled. See, a lot of you have been bamboozled into uh, believing that you're seeing real girls. And I just think that's a crying shame. Here's another Mr. Dancing Girls video. This one's classic. Well, if it comes up, I'm going to put this on hold until I get some cooperation on YouTube. Hang on. Again, here we have the narrow hips and relatively tall. Kind of reminds me uh, of this uh, Alan Jackson uh, song, Tall Lady, A Tall Lady Asks Him, if he has plans for dinner, he says, no thanks, I uh, like the women that sing for soprano. These are guys, or transsexuals. Except possibly the one on the left, with the kid. Th that one's a little on the tough side. She might be legit. I don't know, but I don't think so. These are guys, uh, they're queers, alright? It's gotten to the point where you can't tell the difference anymore. And I think that's a shame. You see the dark sh eye shadow again. Which fewer and fewer women are wearing eyeshadow. American women are, and for that matter, American men are dressing down more and more. And this is a so-called uh, dance contest and chairs. They're very good, but they're not women. They're... Some kind of sickles or something. I just think it's a shame that some of you are being bamboozled by this. It's not just Mr. Dancing Girls. I'll try to pull up one or two more of these fake ones. I hope you can learn to tell the difference. Alright. Alright, this is a video from uh, somebody else. Is more of these Russian women? Uh, well, fake Russian women. I don't know what's going on with this, where they're coming up with all these. Well, these are not women. And some of you are just being bamboozled. These are queers, alright? Uh, 
on those again, if you will, the hips. The hips are not wide enough to accommodate a child, a baby. That's why women have wide hips. That's because their pelvis has to be able to accommodate a baby. More than likely, this is that trans transgender thing. Like I said, I would have that outlawed if it were up to me. You gotta pay attention because there's so many of these videos that, on YouTube that are showing or essentially uh, queers, and. You know, you're being bamboozled and thinking you're seeing girls when you're not. So, watch the feet and hands. The feet are always bigger. The hips are narrow. And they're tall. They're as tall as men. That's one thing you need to look at here. All these so-called women are as tall as men. These are queers. They're not... These aren't women. In her case... I think that's... A, she's probably real. I would think. She looks it. But... Uh... These videos are very good. It's just that... There are these... Body clues that... The surgeons with the transgender stuff can't change. There's some things that they can't change. They can cut your tally whacker off, but they can't uh, change how tall you are. I really wish some of you would just pay more attention because you're being bamboozled. I like looking at girls too, but these aren't girls. I'm sorry. This is Artifacts of Mars. I, was, uh, I hope you uh, learned something from this video. Have a nice day. And thanks for watching.